folytatjuk a Minecraft Story mód második évadát. Most a második epizódra folytatjuk. Ott hagytuk abba, hogy ugye a hegymál fog kellett lezárni, de sajnos még így óriással szembe kell nézni. De itt már ki fog derülni, ki az igazi főbossz. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Old friends come in and move out of life, while new friends show up to fill the spaces left behind. We might not like it, but eventually everyone learns that nothing can escape change forever. No matter how fraught with danger it may seem, the lure of adventure well, cannot be denied. Sometimes the danger itself is the pull. Some heroes just want to be the one to discover the next ancient secret, to wield strange new powers. This new threat was more personal than any that had come before. And the fight for their lives shook the foundation of everything they thought But in the end, the town was saved. The heroes had won the day. And everyone could believe for just one moment that maybe things really hadn't changed at all. And then that moment passed. Greetings, tiny people. I am the admin. Sorry, that was probably really loud to your pathetic, tiny ears. What is it? What? Is it? What is it? scared right now. I wish to speak with Jesse, the gauntlet bearer. What's going on? Where did it come from? Whatever your beef is with me, leave my town out of it. They didn't do anything wrong. It's hard to hear your tiny voice from down there. Come, speak with me face to face. Oh boy. Admin? Have you ever heard of such a thing? Jesse? What's going on here? Gauntlet bearer? That is all rather suspicious, isn't it? No kidding. I don't like it. No sir, I do not like it. Uh, here's the thing, everyone. He's calling me the gauntlet bearer because of this uh, gauntlet thing that I found. It won't come off, and I guess that makes me, like, his chosen one, or something. Okay, so, an admin, a huge colossus in our door. I'm all right with not freaking out, yet. You're going to fix this, right, Jesse? <laughs> you won't let it destroy Beacon Town, will you? Oh, I'm sure Jesse must have thought of something. I've got an idea for everyone. It involves these, especially this one. Maybe I'll go hide somewhere, then. <clears throat> oh, I know, I know. I would like to proceed, Gauntlet Para. Do not test my patience. Guess you should get up there. Gauntlet Bearer. Clay, okay. come in your way. Thanks, Nell. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, it's okay, bitch.
Jesse. I loved what you did with the Witherstorm. Awesome stuff. <laughs> this is going to be perfect. You've got the knack. Why, yes, thanks for noticing. Seriously, you're a natural. That's why I left you the gauntlet. You left it? To tempt you down to the sea temple. Your true test begins. It is time you no! fight. Yeah, I die. Fight me, champion. Unless you'd like to see that happen to your entire town. Who knows what I'll do next? <laughs> Get it now, you are totally cuckoo. Cuckoo. Uh, hold on. Move on. Aha! Fighting in broad daylight is boring. Oh, no, Let's add some drama. Drama. Oh, God, he's powerful. Let's see. Damn. Oh, so much for them. <laughs> Just you and me now. Champion, don't let them down. <laughs> this reminds me of, uh, no, actually, it doesn't. This is pretty bad. All the swords in Beacon Town won't be enough to take this monstrosity down. Who needs swords when you God have the structure damn it. block? Buy me time. I'm gonna plant some arrow towers. That should make tall, dark, and ugly regret smashing my town. No one's a better distraction than me. Go for it. Hey! Woohoo! Chew on me, monster! I never liked Prismarine anyway! What a liar! Say that to my face and I'll show you who's lying. You are! Ha! I'll make you eat your words. Do not get in my threatening range. A little intense, but I guess a giant colossus did follow me oh. home. Hide and seek is beneath you, Jesse. The champion should be better than this. I won't let you win. If you're going to be a coward, Jesse, just give yourself up. I don't think so. A design on the back of his head. I've seen it before. Prismarine soldiers back at the Sea Temple had the same symbol. Aha, Chole Sao Ying Ponti. Fight, you 
or something. Uh, Kay, are you all right? I mean, he really had you up there. I am now. Man, I missed you. Aw, you're just saying that because I pulled you from the literal jaws of doom. <laughs> I sure hope you've got an idea here. I saw a spot on the back of his head that I'm hoping might be the key to defeating him. You calm down. Sounds like I better keep him distracted then. Thanks, Lucas. Be careful. Come now, Jesse. All this stalling is just making me angrier. Hey, Lockhead! You want Jesse? You need to go through me first. And I don't think you stand a chance. You're protecting Jesse. Interruptions are becoming annoying. That ends now. Really something. Stay behind me, Stampy! Ah, don't let the girl please touch me! Oh man, these are gonna keep coming in until we get the sun back up. I think you're gonna make me say no for. Any idea how to use it? Not eat.
This thing could be super dangerous. How sure are you that this admin guy is gone? You make a compelling point, Lucas. My hand is still trapped in this freaky gauntlet. <sighs> yeah. Not to be a worrier, but he might not be as dead as we hope. I I'm worried enough for both of us. Someone should keep an eye on this thing. Yeah. I can take first watch. Actually, <clears throat> Actually I'll volunteer. I want to help. Jesse, I'd say we both do it, but one of us should really get started on the repairs. It's a nice gesture, but maybe you should just let me handle it. Look, I promise, the minute I see anything out of the ordinary, I'm coming to get you as fast as my hustle sticks will carry me. I, my, uh, my legs. Come on, Jesse, I can do this. Jesse's left me in charge before. This is a whole new level, though. All right, Radar. I officially bequeath on you the title of Clockmaster. Thank you, Jesse. I solemnly promise to uphold the duties of Clockmaster and to only use my powers for good. What? Well, yeah, good. That's good. So what are you going to do now? I figured okay, I'd start with Ruben's we'll memorial. Ahead. Got pretty trashed. That's terrible. I'm so sorry. That admin just... No respect. We'll make it right, Jesse. We are going to rebuild. And, um... When I asked you what you're gonna do, I was actually talking about that glove of yours. So I gotta tell you, Jesse, this whole admin thing, it's... Well, it's very you. I guess is what I'm saying. Well, I know you say you're trying to settle down and run Beacon Town, but it just seems like you can't quit that life, you know? I mean, you don't exactly see Axel and Olivia getting mixed up in stuff like this. I don't care if that life keeps trying to drag me back. I like Beacon Town. I like helping people. <sighs> That's great, then. I mean, the people clearly love you. I, uh, I didn't say any of that stuff to be mean. We've had a ton of adventures, and I just want you to be happy. And that's what that little pig wanted for all of us. Now go rebuild his monument. I promised Stampy and Stacy I'd help them get their houses fixed up. Sounds good. I'll see you later, Lucas. Okay. Let's see what we can do for you, buddy.
Тут мы едем в Полцу. There. Now that is a monument fit for Reuben. I know I never met Robin. Robin. <laughs> oh, right. Righteous. Oh, by the way, Petra was looking for you before. Over that away. Thanks, Nell. Pedro, guys. Come on, you remember Twisting Death Cavern? You couldn't even look at a bat for months, right? Oh, oh yes. Uh, they all just start to blur together after a while. Hey, guys, Petra around? Heard she was looking for me. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, helping Nurm get some stuff. Nurm, I see. She should be back in a second. Oh, uh, amazing work fighting that admin fellow, by the way. <laughs> just stunning. Yeah. I would have thought you'd been doing it your whole life. It was... artful. Well, it's not like it was my first battle against an impossible foe. No? Witherstorm. I'll get you the book. It's actually a pretty you good read. Also I think I've got a copy back at the shop. It's a little sad that the legendary Jack, the, the Iron Sword of Muji Lake, has been reduced to some... Uh, tour guide. Voss. That's why I think this adventure to Twisting Death Cavern is just what you need to be <laughs> sure. What you should continue to keep uh, just uh, the talking well, about uh, for someday uh, far off. Uh, yeah. Yeah, agreed. Uh, theoretical conversations. Oh, yeah. yes, yes, quite. Uh, yes, okay, fine. We have a new adventure planned. Hang on, hang on. I missed that last part. If we take that road, it goes through a swamp and a mesa biome? Hmm. Okay, okay, then it's settled. The earlier we leave, the better. Wait, you're leaving with these guys? Uh, yeah. And that's, uh, yeah. That's why we were, um being weird before and uh, you know talking about uh, you know bus possible stuff we haven't even rebuilt yet petra well i didn't think you needed me for that jesse i, I promise I, I can explain i just oh wait what yes This isn't a The admin. The one and only. I had so much fun Ooh, during our last little battle. Super epic. Just couldn't stay away. Wait, you're the admin? Well, that giant... Prismarine Colossus. <laughs> Just a construct. Rolled it up for the occasion. Pretty fun, right? I just thought it'd be a little easier to talk like this. Well, it's kind of cuddly, right? I don't know what kind of game you're playing, but you're being a jerk. You could seriously hurt should... people. Oh, come on. Come on, don't do me like that. Yeah, you have to admit, you've been having a little fun along the way. All those guardian fish, the temple. Hey, see, you four went into my temple, back out alive. Heroes, you're perfect for my creations. Perfect. Where are you going with yeah, this? Yeah, Got a new challenge for you. Trust me, you're gonna love it. 
class wave of doom and destruction headed right for town. <laughs> Pretty good, right? I'm working on that one. You're insane. Hmm. You'll never get away with this. I know you have your plans or whatever, but leave my people out of it. They're innocent. <laughs> innocent or incentive? Yeah, of course. I don't know. Seems like they've got you pretty motivated. <clears throat> Your town will be trapped in eternal snowy night, forever plagued by deadly waves of mobs, until you recapture that club. Which is a fair order. I'm glad you asked. It's at the tippy top of my awesome, fantastic, super deadly, icy palace of despair. It's simple. Just follow the path. You can't miss it. Well, that sounds needlessly dangerous. Oh, it is. I mean, I don't want to brag, but... It is, like, <laughs> really hard. You're putting innocent people in danger just for your games? Well, yeah, well, technically, you're the one putting them in danger if you don't go after the clock. So, uh, Why are you doing this? What do you want from us? You don't ask to borrow. Why? <laughs> Why? Well, because it's fun, obviously. I mean, this is gonna be epic. What? Oh, come on! Time to show this goon with the Skitaro Crag Jumpers due to town destroyers. Yes, sir! You think you've got it all figured out, don't you? Ah, oh, strays. Pesky little consequences of eternal night. And <laughs> Beacon Town's new neighbors until you take care of that clock. Remember? Find the clock, save the town. Bye bye now. Ah, oh, we need to protect the people. Okay, then. Thank you. Hide everyone. I've got a bad feeling more will be on the way soon. Guys? Jesse, I am so sorry. I, I was standing guard watching it so close, but it just disappeared. I know. Now the Good situation on. is just going to get worse until we get it back. Yeah. From so this icy palace right. of despair, it's or whatever. Wherever you're going, I'm coming too. I was given the title and the power of Clockmaster. If it's to keep Beacon Town safe, I'll do anything. Really? Really? I thought you were too scared to do things like this. I... Yeah, this I thought I was too. But I just feel like there are times when the little guy needs to step up. And well, maybe this is my time. All right, everyone, we've got a clock to find. Can't let you come along on this one, old friend. Hmm. I promise. I will come back. Hmm. Just protect the town while we're gone, Beep all right? Is that thing gone? Yeah, for now. I mean, block this up after we leave, would you? On it. Yes, we will defend Beacon Town with our very lives. Thanks, guys. Bye, Nerm. Hmm. We're all counting on you. I wish I knew more about whatever their quest is. Oh, 
Következő fejezet. Sounds suspicious, but do we really think the admin is going to keep his word about this clock? Yeah, I don't exactly get a trustworthy vibe off of him. If he knows what's good for him, he better keep his deal. We get the clock, the town's freed from eternal darkness. And hey, if he doesn't stick to the deal, we'll just need to find another punchier way to convince him. <laughs> Punch you. Jesse, uh, can we, um, talk? Let's see it. I'll just walk a little more over here. Oh, uh, right. Uh, uh, me, me, me too. About that trip with Jack. I promise it's not like it seems. It's just a little trip. A little time away from Beacon Town. To... I don't know. Find myself? You're gonna come back, right? Sure. Uh, of course. So did you? I... I really am sorry that it happened this way. I, I was just so excited to be hanging out with real hardcore adventurers again. Especially because I was worried that you... that you didn't need me anymore. Oh, you are so not helping. Yes, I did. Ugh, see, this is why it would have been so much easier if you hadn't found out like this. It's just... Everything's so different from when we first became friends. Everything's... Need that changed. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, they all changed too. Need they found what made them happy. They thought that was the thing. I still haven't found mine. Do you know how hard that is? How, how that feels? It's okay. I know I can't expect you to have all the answers for everything. Luna? Uh, is that a scarf on that llama? Huh. Think she ran away again? Uh, excuse me. Speaking for the group, you guys know a llama? Where'd she come from? This is Luna. She's kind of cute, right? We returned her to her owner, Stella. She is cute, isn't she? Of course, Stella. Everyone get away from my llama. No. Jesse, my rival. Should have known I would find you here. Hush, I'm talking. Yeah, hi, Stella. Hi? That's all you have to say for yourself. <laughs> okay. What is going on here? Lucas, this is Stella, the leader of Champion City. This is Jack, Voss, and Radar. Jacques, was it? As in the legendary champion? So, what exactly are you doing here, Stella? Vacation. My beautiful city is currently covered in a hideous coat of snow. That's what. I came out Sorry, to investigate, and surprise, surprise, it's you. If you're smart, you'll undo whatever it is you did and put things right again. Just. wow. It wasn't me that did this, it was the admin. Admin that, that. Huh, I don't know who this Adam is, but it seems awfully rude to pin it on him. No, admin. Ad-min. He's like, oh, he's a big, giant, bad guy. Super powerful. Hmm. All right, let's say I believe you. I suppose I'll just have to find a way to fix it. It's my world too, after all. 
You'll see, I'll fix it all. He says he don't call volunteer heels. Any of you losers. Whoa, the the moon is stuck. So, Stella, you were saying? I was saying that maybe I'll stick around for a bit, just to keep an eye on you. You know I'm all for trying to find my own path, but does it really have to have Stella on it? <laughs> Do I get to visit? Okay, Radar? Yes, yes, totally fine. Guys, shh. We need to keep an eye. Whoa. Ooh, yeah. oh, I'm actually kind of speechless right now. Man, and it's all ice? <laughs> Astounding. Yeah, <laughs> I know. It looks like the sort of buildings I've always dreamt of building. Hey, found the clock. Perfect, but how are we gonna get up there? Well, the admin mentioned challenges. I'm guessing there's gonna be like obstacles or something when we get. <laughs> Wait, do I have this right? Are you telling me that this admin is so powerful he built all of this instantly? You seem yeah, almost jealous. Almost. Of course, I'm jealous of power like that. Power is how the world is run, little man. It's what people respect, what they listen to. Oh, yeah, I'm actually you jealous so? too. Can you imagine being able to build oh, something man. like that? Just like that? Oh, look at us. Maybe we're not so different after all. Ugh. Oh, Stella, you'll never change. Oh, I thought I recognized you. You're the quitter who used to work on my inventory management team. Wait, wait, do, do you two know each other? Uh, yeah, I, uh, I used to live in Champion City. What? Uh... I don't know what he told you to get on this little team, but I don't think he even knows how to use a sword. Thank you, oh, you don't know anything, Stella, so zip it. Ooh, how do you put up with that little voice of his, Jesse? I know I never could. If I remember correctly, Stella, I saw a certain someone pretending to be another certain someone, and she wasn't so good with a sword either. Oh, really? You act so high and mighty, but you really are just a bully sometimes. You know that? Come on, Luna. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. I appreciate that. I'm not the person she thinks I am anymore. I've changed. And I can prove it. I can be different. Braver. If that's what the situation requires, I'll do it. I'll do whatever it takes to save Beacon Town. Would you look at that? Haven't seen anything that grand since the last time I visited the overcompensating builders of Igesh. No kidding! Oh boy, my favorite. Mystery levers. <laughs> Good man. Was a company. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, this place is really for the best of the best. Not, uh, how do I say this? Losers? Mr. Admin, mighty sir. I'm Stella, founder of Champion City. Maybe you've heard of me? No, never. No, it's actually all. perfect, Champion. I can see you all have dreams of greatness. It's very cute. This construct before you, it's meant to see who's worthy of that greatness. Separate the strong 
Oh boy, I do. I do. Jimmy, give me a go at it. We'll see how your little companions do. Hey, and who exactly made you the judge? Um, my near infinite power. I thought that was obvious. Like I said, Radar, power runs the world. Oh, come now, don't be that way. This, this is all for you. New creatures of my own design, as well as mining fatigue at every turn. Wouldn't want you cheating, of course. I don't like rule breakers. It's simple. You all want to get to that clock, but only the best of the best get to partner up with me in the future. But that could be you. Cook this place up just for you. I mean, it's pretty... Well, I was going to say pretty cool, but with the whole ice motif, that just seems like I was going for a lame pun, so... Anyway. I'm here to save my town. Well, of course you are, because you're a hero. <laughs> it's awesome. Oh, 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 I am just ecstatic that you see things my way. Thrilled! <laughs> so, how about we get this show on the road? Sandy! Landing. Uh, oh my God, that is just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Well, that's it then. The way is shut. Yes. Now I suppose the only way out is through. Yeah. Exactly. Smashing that clock. Well, we're not all going to be smashing the clock. Say what now? You heard the admin. He only wants the best of the best. And that's going to be me. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Sorry, handsome. Might as well quit now. Stella, come on. The admin is dangerous enough as it is. Let's not add to that by fighting with each other. Oh, Jesse. That sort of reverse psychology isn't going to work on me. Especially not for my own rival. I... Seriously? Oh, yeah. little buddy Jesse you know anything about this partnership he's offering imagine everything you could create everything you could do with a prize like that how can we even be certain he's telling the truth all I know is that I don't trust anything the admin says uh, I'd agree with that come on Luna enough of these losers we've got treasure to find hey. you the this Treasure sniffing llama. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tell your friends. Each uh, other. Hey now. Oh, that poor llama. What? Let's go, Luna. Let's go, Miss Well, that is certainly a woman who knows what she wants. Are you kidding? She's nuts. Uh, well, no one knows better than me that the admin's traps and constructions mean business. You've got a point there, old friend. I don't want to see anyone else get hurt. Yes. And it's like the admin said. Not everyone here might be uh, up for the task. I mean no offense by it. Just uh, stating facts. And I guess we're just gonna have to prove how wrong the admin is. Ah, <sighs> fine. But if something happens to them, that's on you, not me. Come with me, Jack. On, Jack. Let's try and scope this place out. I'm. I'm gonna go talk to them. Well, I have never been so offended. Not in my whole life. Yeah, that wasn't the coolest. Oh, oh, was it the coolest? Oh, no. Miss filing your acacia wood during material organization week isn't the coolest. That was... That was a stripe too far. But just because I'm not some sword-swinging meathead, they think they can just walk on... Okay, 
they, they think they, they look at me and my, well, my, my skinny little arms and, and they think they know me. They think they know me. Well, they are wrong. Dead wrong. I mean, I have been an embarrassment sometimes, but it stops here. It ends today. And I... <clears throat> I guess I'm done. Sorry. I need you to remember that out there, the world is stuck in eternal night. There are a lot of scared people back in Beacon Town who are counting on us. You're right. Uh, we were talking and decided that it would be best for everyone if Radar stays here with Lucas while we go get the clock. <laughs> That's it, Luna, darling. <laughs> She's got the clock sent. <laughs> Later, losers. We're wasting time. Wait. It's like Jesse said. We can't trust the admin. Sure, it looks like Luna found something, but that's... Just what the admin wants us to think. You saw the llama! Jesse, you're coming, right? I can really use a hand over here. I can really use a hand over here. Tudo isso que o Lucas só. Vai, tudo isso que vai trazer. Visando que a gente já está tipo em duas linhas aí, só vai ter tudo. I gotta go with them. Be safe, okay? Das boas fartos de nada. If you're sure. I knew you'd make the smart choice. Mas eu não quero que o macho gosta de fazer isso. Isso é grande! Oh, meu Deus! Oh! 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 Everybody okay? Definitely. What a rush. I'm all right. I'm okay. I am so sorry. I'm okay. Really. Just getting my adventure legs. I'll be better in a minute. No worries. Minecarts are the worst. Yeah, just ooh, feeling real sick. <laughs> right, Lucas? What? Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> definitely. Ooh, minecarts. Uh, you, you guys didn't have to do that. But thanks. I gotta say, if you're having a hard time with the minecarts, you might not find what comes next. Hello there, it's me again. Your friendly neighborhood admin. <laughs> again, it's a waddle. Pretty proud of this challenge, not gonna lie. I was feeling very inspired by the concept of karma. Karma. I'd tell you why, but well, that'd spoil the surprise. I'm sure you understand, right? Real heroes live for surprises. Unexpected dangers. This is all... Duh! My town's in danger and you're playing games. It's all games, champion. Winning, losing. That's what life's all about. Now, once you figure that out, you'll be much happier. Let's just say I hope you're feeling good about your archery skills. Hmm? Between you and me, though, champion, I'm less worried about your archery than I am about your choice of companions. Let's see if I can't... Shuffle the board a bit. Hmm? Give you 
another pair of hands to help out? Where? How? He's no Jesse. But he's better than that other guy, right? Oh, 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 dear. All you need to do is activate the shooting gallery, hit all the targets, and the door will open. <laughs> Easy, right? Okay, but what are those pumpkin heads for? Don't worry, Jesse. We'll figure it out. I'm telling you, it's magical. Oh, that's good. Oh, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Arrows, perfect for shooting targets with. Just need a bow. Bow. Okay. All torn. Always good to have string around. Time to meet your maker. some targets, huh? <laughs> he really reminds me of us. You know, back in the day, eager to make his mark. Always ready for whatever's around the next corner. I still worry about him. He's got a lot to learn. So I'll get on. <laughs> so did we. Man, sometimes I still can't believe how far we've come. Come on. I need to turn this stupid thing on. <laughs> Looks like he needs our help. Shoot. All right, button, you're mine. That's all. What's the total damage now? I'm on zero. This is so cool. All right, Lucas, show the admin who he's messing with.
Well, that was a little tougher. Man, Jason, you're good. I'm definitely gonna steal some of those moves. Here comes round three. Edge form. Yes. Well, I'm the head. It's in this little pool, Tazmo. That's so hot, da. Nam, it's not us. Nemboj, 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 nic si nemboj. Shot. Almost feels like I made this challenge too easy for you. Oh wait, okay, yeah. no, I'm totally messing with you. Time for level two. <laughs> you are. Oh, by my.
man. Radar, you did it. No, I don't know. Damn it, damn. Take that, you big dumb chunk of ice. All right, time to get ourselves a pumpkin and open it. Let's go, Mister Sarah. Come on, before he thinks up a stage three. That was oh wow. I mean Voss. That wasn't your fault, Radar. Voss has to be somewhere in this place. We'll find him. Taste my bravery? Well, I figured it was appropriate. That was intense. Would it be weird for me to go in for a hug? Cause uh, I'm kind of feeling the hug vibe right now. Maybe. Let's stick to a high five, all right? It's cooler. Yeah, super cool. Hmm. Petra. Hey, have you guys seen Voss? One second he was with us, and the next gone. <laughs> Oh, hello, Hoser. No, 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 no! No one deserves this. Not even Stella. She might be a bit stuck up, and she doesn't really treat anyone that nicely. But she's a person too. Stella's been totally impossible, but that doesn't mean we shouldn't help her. Uh, you have a point. Uh, uh, okay, no, 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 no. This is all wrong, people. Wrong. You're not supposed to help each other. The losers are supposed to lose. Like spectacles over here. There was no way my dog would have fought his way out of that room without you. You should have just cut him loose. Jettison that baggage. Seeing someone like you held back by that? Oh, painful. I don't get you, Admin. If you didn't want people to succeed, then why build this place at all? You don't get it. I'm trying to separate the diamonds from the gravel here. Rubbish gets dumped. Go cut that! There is this big one. Fine, you convince me. It's not often I give second chances. Come on, mask your shit. Condition, though. No! 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 Oh man, not good! No! But he's so small. Let's see how our bucko does on his own, eh? What do you think the chances are without Jesus? you? Ah. Don't worry, guys. Everything is okay. Oh, oh, oh no! Definitely. Oh no! This is not good. We have to do something. Floating lava? That's just that's crazy. There's a door. Go for the door! He's not gonna make it. You can't just stand here. Jesse! Here we go. Radar, the door! Jesse! Jesse, I just had a thought. Maybe, maybe I can do this. Maybe I am a hero. That's uh, Oslet, dude. You're not! La Oslet. Radar! Radar, stay close. Told us to go through his stupid challenge, but maybe we could find another way. Did anyone? Luna? If that llama can get to the other side of the wall, so can we. 
Bond. that. Anyone got anything to make a pickaxe? I have some sticks. Three diamonds. It sounds like a diamond pickaxe to me. Can I someone get a beat, Danny? Hate to point out the obvious, but we can't climb. That feels good. Oh no. Thank you so much for now. Oh, I've got a beat. Click it to face it. Okay. 
I got a feeling they won't be gone for long. <clears throat> Jesse, hello. Stella. I hey, could have found that clock, obviously, but there was some signage that was very confusing. And well, I, you know, wound up here. <clears throat> Kept hoping the admin would drop by so I could explain the confusion. But when we do talk, you better believe that he's gonna realize I am the perfect friend and partner for him. You know, Stella, now that I think about it, you and the admin would be perfect for each other. Jesse, I swear. <laughs> Thank you. I've had a bit of a hard day. I needed that. Fine. Enough chit-chat. How about you get me on out of here? You are unbelievable. Thank you. Not that one. Yeah. Wow. Okay, fine. Just don't make me regret it. All right? Knew hey, you Bonda. would. Our fates are intertwined, after all. Who are either of us without the other? Ow. Uh, I think I'm not that much of a number of people. Go, Jack. Come on, guys, let's get up to him. would never have survived in my sea temple that long. I am disappointed, Jesse. Told you that. obviously just don't have what it takes to really be my friend. My God, 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 God. Such a pity. Such a waste. Are you serious? I would never be your friend. You're nuts. And you? <laughs> well, you are incredibly bold. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Admin, sir. 
I just wanted to say that I would love to be your partner. But you... lost. Technically, yes. But unlike them, I actually appreciate what you're offering. You don't say. Stella, I don't know what your plan is here, but it's going to backfire. Backfire? Jesse, sweetie, I'm telling the truth. Jesse, I really appreciate you saving me. Love ya. Mean it. But you obviously don't understand the magnitude of what this... this paragon is offering. Oh. Stella. Uh, Stella, was it? Yes, sir. See, she may not have the skills, but that is a terrific attitude. Your attitude, on the other hand? Oh, well... There's nothing that hurts more than broken hopes. I made this for you. Just you know, for you. And how do you repay me? You cheated! How could God, you do this to me? What's going on, damn? Hey, we did exactly what you said, didn't we? We got your stupid clock. Nah, nope. You were more interested in saving those loser friends of yours. That practically negates all of the other stuff. I oh, gave you it. so many chances. So can she. <laughs> Never for <fought> someone. But <laughs> it has no orbit to waste. No, no. You might not be worthy. What? Technically, Jack here was the winner. Oh, don't get me wrong. There are quite a few flaws we'll have to work through, but we'll get there. In time? No! You can't! Ooh, Jack! Where did he go? Oh, I'm in. Oh, don't even worry about it. It's not for a loser like you to worry about where the cool people go. Jack! No! <laughs> Shh! Like I said, not for you guys to worry about. I think I'm done just... letting you make me feel bad. I prefer to feel good. And I'm gonna feel real good when I send you two to a place where you'll never see the light of day. Ever again. No! Yes, Yay! <laughs> going off. It's so good, I said, with the leader of Storm. Ő volt a főbossz. Kis égazi rohani.
must be a special class of trouble to end up here. The admin. Well, this is where he sends the people who he has special plans for. You may have noticed, it's not a very nice place. And the people? Well, they're not very nice either. <laughs> Okay. We mean these are left more up. That's a dire now J house block. Oh man, because I wanna report to you, can you vote Mara?